Now, stars from TV and theatre gathered in Coventry today to honour an African-American actor called Ira Aldridge. It's the 150th anniversary of his death. The playwright pioneer found a safe haven in the city back in the 19th century when slavery was at its height. The day was especially poignant for a veteran actor from Kenilworth who was determined to attend the commemoration, as Trisha Dudu reports. Looking back with wife Barbara on a lifetime of acting success, Earl Cameron, who turns 100 next week, has worked with them all. Sean Connery in Thunderball, Helen Mirren, Nicole Kidman, as well as in Doctor Who. But for movies to remembrance, he's heading to Coventry today to mark the 150th anniversary of this man, Ira Aldridge, whose daughter Amanda helped shape his early career. She was very charming, very gentle. She had such lovely graces, you know. And she would, from time to time, talk about her, her, her father, Ira Aldrich, the great Ira Aldrich. But I'm not copying her. But you're not. Look, Aldrich not inspired copying. many actors, like I'm Nicholas Bailey, you. who starred in EastEnders with Earl, and both joined Coventry's community in honouring Aldrich, who fled America in 1828 at the height of slavery to perform Shakespeare and manage Coventry's Theatre Royal. He's a fantastic inspiration to us. He's the reason why I'm here. He's a real pioneer. He inspired the people around, around him and the people of Coventry recognised that to their credit. And the people of Coventry accepted him and gave him that chance. He was 20 years old. And it's people like Ira Aldridge, my I, I'm a Shakespearean actor today. And there was one last Shakespearean treat in store. Trisha Tudu, Midlands Today, Coventry. It's time for the weather. Horrible stuff over the past.